Test. Module 7. Listen and match the speakers 1 to 5 with the statements A to E. Speaker 1. I think the environment is in such a mess. Where I live, the pollution is absolutely terrible. And it's a shame because I think most people would like to do something about it, but they don't know where to start. Living in the city, I'm not very close to nature, but I try to do whatever I can. I make a donation every month to an organisation that helps species that are about to become extinct, like blue whales. There aren't many left in the world, you know. I know it's not much, but at least it's something. Speaker 2. It seems like the environment is just getting worse and worse. Every day I see people on TV demonstrating about pollution or using alternative energy instead of fossil fuels. It's good to see people caring, but sometimes I feel like it's a bit too late. Maybe too much damage has already been done. Speaker 3. I know that there are many parts of my lifestyle that aren't very environmentally friendly. I mean, I drive a car a lot, and I've got three dogs, which is supposed to be pretty bad for the planet. But I've decided to improve my lifestyle and make some changes to my house. I'd like to install wind power and solar power, but it might be a bit too expensive. Speaker 4. To be honest, I don't really follow environmental issues. I can't stand it when people harm animals. But I think that it's only human nature. But last week, something made me start seeing things differently. It was when my friends asked me to join them in the city centre. We were trying to stop the council building another car park, and the passion of my friends and all the others really impressed me. I'll definitely go again next time. Speaker 5. I used to do a lot to help the environment in the past. My dad didn't let me go on protest demonstrations with him, but I used to help him make the signs. There are a lot of issues which need to be dealt with, but I think helping animals is most important to me. I frequently go to the zoo, and there are lots of endangered species there. They look so unhappy most of the time. They shouldn't be locked up like that. They should be free, but if we keep destroying their environment, they haven't got much choice, have they?